Fight of the year for 2022. Now, obviously, there's been, there's been quite a few fights. Obviously, an exciting fight. You will pull out there, Joe Joyce and Parker. Um, you got Clarissa Shields, Savannah Marshall. You got Katie Taylor, Serrano. But for me, Lee Wood and Michael Conlon. That fight was, it was a great fight. Honestly, seeing like I honestly didn't believe that Lee Wood would actually make it, yeah, out of the second round after getting dropped in round one. Uh, it was a lot of but say back and forth, but it was more of a thing where Lee Wood was chasing chasing the fight, and obviously him dropping Conlon in the I want to say. I want to say it's the 11th round. Yeah, it was the 11th round. And then to knock him out in the 12th, put him through the ropes. Great fight. So I don't know. I don't know what you guys are saying. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know what you guys are saying out there. But Lee Wood, Michael Conlon, fight of the year. Like, I know a lot of people say Katie Taylor, Madison Serrano. Now, yeah, there was a round in round five where we all thought Katie Taylor was going. Like we all thought that's it, she's getting stopped. She's getting stopped. She hanged in there. And the way these two girls were swinging it from the like for the last, what's it, 20 seconds? Yeah, they, yeah, it was an entertaining fight, but the atmosphere lived up to the expectation. The fight lived up to the expectation. But yeah, for me, without a shadow of a doubt, Lee Woods, Conlon, great fight. And if you go back and remember that everyone was concerned on Michael Conlon. How is he going to be? How is he going to... Um, is he all right? Got checked up and all that, which is good, gracefully. Obviously, he's had a comeback win since then. And, yeah, if they, if those two guys go out again, I will not be... Yeah, I wouldn't say no to that. But, yeah. So that's my fight of the year. Make sure you like, share, comment and subscribe.